Hello, beautiful women. Uh, this is Kira King here, and we are going to be um, participating in some group um, womb energy work. So when you jump on or if you're watching the replay, um, just know that this, uh, the energy work that we are going to be doing today um, could release um, any sort of stagnant, uh, stagnation um, that is lingering in the womb space. So I'm actually not doing any sort of one-on-one -on -one work. This is just going to be a group, um, a group, a group setting to where you're actually going to be working on yourself. All right. So I'm going to lead you through a practice that you can, you can download this video, you can watch it. I'm going to leave this up in the group so that way you can revisit this over and over. Okay. This is something that I pro I practice, um, and that has, uh, that has had a profound effect in my body. And I'm, I'm very thrilled to, sorry, I'm just making some adjustments to share this with you. So before we begin, you're going to take your left hand and place it over the left ovary and your right hand over the right ovary. So go ahead and do this before we begin. All right. So I'm placing my hands over my left and right ovary and you can actually make it to where your, your fingers, your thumbs are touching and then your, um, your first fingers are touching and then the, so pointing downward. So it's like a downward triangle and then the left and right hand is naturally just going to uh, touch over the left and right ovary. So go ahead and make, sorry, I have to make another adjustment. There we go. Um, go ahead and place your hands in that space. And I'm just, I'm going to direct this with my eyes closed. Okay. And I'm just going to take my glasses off as well. And take a deep breath in and just make any sort of micro movements that you need for your body to ra relax into to yourself. Take a deep inhalation into the chest and roll your shoulders back, actively roll your shoulders back and that's going to gently lift the heart space open and exhale your shoulders down. Now begin to become aware of the space of where your hips meet the ground, the surface you are sitting or lying down. And begin to transfer your awareness and your breath deep into the pelvis. And just take notice of your breath here. Just become aware of the natural rise and fall of your chest, your belly, your low belly. Allowing yourself to bring your awareness deep into the pelvis, your pelvic floor. And we're going to activate aspects of our womb space by doing a Kegel. So it's going to be an uplift an energetic uplift into the womb space. Now, begin to visualize in your left hand and your right hand a ball of energy in each. And allow that just to begin to spiral in your hands. So in your left hand, there's a ball of light spiraling. And in the right hand, there is a ball of light spiraling. And you're going to transfer that ball of light into the belly, into the left and right ovary. And we are allowing the left and right ovary to absorb, absorb the energy. Visualize and just come in contact. Say hi, say hello to the ovaries, the fallopian tubes, 
the uterus, the cervix, the vaginal walls, the vaginal canal, outward to the vulva, to the clitoris, and the energy, the energetic space between the groin. Now transferring that light from your hands into the ovaries, down through the fallopian tubes, into the uterus, through the cervix, through the vaginal walls, down, outward, through the groin space. Let it, allowing it to run. Now we're going to act as if your left and right ovary were a second pair of lungs. Begin to pretend, or if you can, if you're, if you are energetically sensitive, you might be able to feel this a little bit deeper. But imagine that your left ovary is another lung and operating in opening and closing. Simultaneously, the right side is opening and closing and begin to breathe with intention through your ovaries. Inhaling, inhaling light through the left ovary and inhaling light through the right ovary. And inhaling through the left fallopian tube, through the right. And this light is dissolving any sort of emotions or thoughts, feelings that have been held in the womb space that no longer serve you and your vessel. We are giving ourselves and our bodies permission to naturally shed any sort of stagnant, limiting emotions, beliefs that have been held in the womb. Now, visualize your entire uterus breathing. Your uterus is actually giving off a pulse, a separate pulse or energy very similar to the heart space. And begin to transfer and breathe from that space. Filling the uterus with light and allowing it, just taking notice that inside of you, this part of you is breathing. It is your elixir of life. And this power center of your womb. is naturally transcending any held emotions, feelings, thoughts that you may subconsciously be holding on to. Now in the center of the womb space, I want you to visualize another ball of light and draw a line from the center of the womb as if you were drawing a cord of light and bring that to the center of the cervix. And again, just to energize that space, you can do a Kegel. But directly from the cervix, there's a cord, a light cord from your uterus upwards. Now we're going to spin this energy in a counterclockwise motion, opening the energy, the healing, and creative energy of the service cervix up into the uterus. So spin a ball of light from the cervix upward into the uterus, filling all of this space with revitalizing, energizing creative light through the uterus, up through the fallopian tubes, into the ovaries, out into your hands. And now breathe with the entire space of the womb. Feel how expansive your womb space is, how powerful. You might begin to feel the difference of how 
your womb is pulsating and giving off its own frequency, its own electronic signature. Breathe up from the cervix into the uterus, through the fallopian tubes, into the ovaries. And taking your awareness into the vaginal canal, around the clitoris, around the vulva, into the space between the groin, infusing this space with light, opening, receiving, cleansing, healing, as this light that has been filled in the womb now overflows downward through the vaginal canal into the clitoris around the vulva out into the groin space it's now flowing open good and we're going to take this a step further where you're actually breathing upward now upward through the vaginal canal into the uterus in through the fallopian tubes into the left and right ovaries transferring that energy into the hands and backwards sending that light through the ovaries through the fallopian tubes into the womb through the cervix through the vaginal canal out through the groin so inward inhale this light up through the womb into the hands and exhale down And with each breath, this light is dissolving and releasing any sort of held emotions, thoughts, beliefs, any resistance to opening or receiving. Now we're going to ask now for our sacred feminine power, only known to our soul, and our individual womb frequency be ignited in this space. So we're going to allow and envision the doors around our ovaries. So on your left and right ovary, each one has a door. We're going to open the doors and receive our sacred feminine power our divine feminine essence, our feminine wisdom, our sacred connection to the womb space cosmically, individually, and into the earth womb. Allowing yourself to keep breathing through the womb space, receiving your sacred feminine divine knowledge and wisdom. Allowing any sort of wounds you may have been holding in this space are quickly easily dissolved and replaced with nourishment, creativity, your sacred feminine power, and instant healing, innocence, purity. And power. Now breathe upward, bring that energy up through the vaginal canal into the womb, through the fallopian tubes, into the ovaries, into your hands, and exhale downward through the ovaries, through the fallopian tubes, down through the uterus, through the cervix, outward down through the vaginal canal. And whenever you feel um, that you're ready to disconnect you can go ahead and disconnect and if you connected to that um, you're f you feel free to leave a comment or you can just keep on breathing through your womb and you can revisit this anytime that you feel it would benefit you. I hope that this helps you. I know that I connected to it. I hope that you did as well. And I hope that this 
helped you in any any way feel free again to revisit this anytime that you feel that you feel it's it's good for you it's a good practice and I think it's definitely a good practice um, you can use this technique if you um, are using a yoni egg if you are hey Theo hi Pamela hi Erica hi Ario hi Brittany um, hi Deneen hi Diana you're welcome um, if you do any sort of vaginal steaming or if you are um, in, in any sort of meditation or visualization practice again I'm going to leave this video up in the group I hope it serves you feel free um, to share this with other women as well um, meaning if you would like to teach it <laughs> feel free or share the video whatever works um, many blessings to you thank you for being a part of um, this sacred space I look forward to learning more about you and sharing more of our journey as women together bye